Hey guys, today we are going to have some garam chai at the tea stall. While I was standing here, I noticed that the chai wala is not using a sieve to filter the tea. Instead, he is filtering it through a muslin cloth. The liquid tea passes through the cloth and the insoluble tea leaves stay back on the cloth. The liquid obtained after filtration is called the filtrate and the solid left on top is called the precipitate or the residue. Can you think of another example where a similar technique is used? Tea bags. The tea leaves are stored in a pouch made of filter paper. When you dip a tea bag in hot water, the water seeps through the filter paper and then the flavor from the tea leaf mixes with the water. In this case, the residue remains inside the tea pouch. Filtration is one method of separating solid particles from a liquid. Another method to separate solid from liquid is sedimentation. You're likely to see this happening in your glass of chocolate milk. If you do not mix the granules properly and let the milk stay still in the glass, after some time, the heavy solid particles will settle at the bottom of the glass. The heavy solid particles that settle down are called sediments and the liquid that stays on top is called supernatant. If you slowly pour the liquid into another container without disturbing the sediment, the process is called decantation. Sedimentation is used often to remove impurities from water. Sometimes a chemical substance like alum is added to speed up the process of sedimentation and this method is called loading. Let's learn about another method to separate solid from liquids. Evaporation. This is a glass of salt water. Can you see the salt in the glass? No, because it is completely dissolved. To separate the two, we can heat the water. The liquid water will change to gaseous state and evaporate leaving the solid salt crystals behind. Evaporation is mostly used to separate soluble solids that dissolve in a liquid. Hmm, talking about tea, chocolate milk and salt water have made me quite thirsty. I'm going to get myself a hot cup of chocolate milk. See you next time.